Hi friends, today I'm gonna be making seaweed chicken in grated daikon dashi broth. It is called mizoreni. This is a traditional Japanese dish served as like main course. Grated daikon promotes good digestion and adds more flavor and creates the unique texture to the dashi broth. And it's ready in no time. Let's get started. Remove the skin from the chicken side and cut into bite-sized pieces. In a bowl, add ginger juice and 1 tablespoon of sake from the seasonings and toss to coat. What this does is season the chicken lightly and remove any unwanted smell. Add potato starch to coat the outside. Potato starch will thicken the broth and creating a smooth texture. Next, let's grate the daikon. Grated daikon radish is often used in Japanese cuisine to add refreshing aroma and unique texture to the dish. When I was little, it was my job to grate daikon, and I didn't like it because I wasn't good at it. But now I have a good grater that doesn't need a muscle to grate, so it's more like exercise. You can use any grater you have on your hand. Taste the grated daikon at this point, and if your daikon tastes bitter, rinse under the cold running water to remove the bitterness. Bring water to a boil, add dashi powder, soy sauce, preferably light soy sauce, mirin and sake. Add prepared chicken and cover and cook for 5 minutes on medium heat. After 5 minutes, the broth slightly thickens from the potato starch, which is good, and add grated daikon, squeeze out the excess moisture. You don't have to squeeze out all the moisture, but if you left too much moisture, the broth will not taste good. Bring it to a boil again, and it's done. Serve immediately while it's hot and garnish with chopped scallion. Chicken is so tender and the broth is so flavorful, and the slightly thickened broth, everything makes this dish so unique and so delicious. I hope you will give this recipe a try. Thank you for watching the video. Give me a big thumbs up and share the video with your friends and families. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Follow me on the social media and tag me on your post if you give it a try. And join my happy eating group to share your food with me. And my store on Amazon has pretty much everything that I'm using in my video. Thanks again and I will see you soon. Bye!